Oh, I want to get yeah. the rainbow too. I wish we can get this rainbow. Um, oh, that's really nice. Yeah, it's okay. But I don't know whether this video can actually um, capture the rainbow. But anyway, oh, but I think the rainbow is coming in right there. Perfect. Oh, that's nice. <laughs> okay, so say hello with our feet. Hello. Yeah. Hello. Yeah. hello. How are you, everybody? Today, what we're going to do? We actually just finished our one side, but uh, we're going to do the one side so that this video won't be too long um, to give you guys um, a better relaxation for your toe muscles, your foot muscles, and your sole and your atlas tendon. Um, it's very important to um, release and um, the muscles so that your toe functions actually. Um, better whenever you walk and you really have to put a lot of um, power onto a big toe sometimes when the muscles get really shortened down right underneath and this actually creates later on going into the bunion <laughs> you see a lot of people actually putting their big toes going into one side right so let's try to prevent that and also this will be able to um, help you to really you know, relax your, your body at the same time help it to uh, improve your blood circulation, limb circulation as well as we can strengthen your entire toe joint and your soles and your ankle uh, flexibilities and mobility. How about that? Okay, so let's go ahead and start. So this is for you, Mary. And yeah, so this um, bowl, um, I'll uh, put a little uh, link under my comment uh, section so you'll be able to buy this. It's very soft, you know, it's very nice. So we're gonna start from the big toe. You see, can you guys see? Alright, yeah. We're gonna start from the big toe. So let's try to do. Oh, I have a rainbow here. You get the rainbow? Yeah. I got the rainbow right there. <laughs> okay, so we have a little rainbow coming right here. So, yeah, it's nice. Okay, so let's try to do this. So, we're gonna start from big toes right here, right above your nail and uh, your toenail. So, we're gonna use your bowl starting from the center and press it really hard and up and down. Very good. Very nice. It's, it's okay to press it really hard, it's totally fine. Totally fine. And we're going to do it about 20 seconds. And also make sure to come all the way up here. Follow with this line. And very good. How you feeling? Good. Yeah. And let's move it on to the second toe. Okay. Imagine that you really stretch the toes. Stretch them out. Stretch them out. Stretch them out. Okay, especially this area, make sure to actually press a little harder to release any tight um, muscle or ligament. Really, really hard. Yeah, very nice. And then we're gonna do the third one right here. Okay. Oh, Melissa, I have a rainbow coming in right here. Do you wanna come a little closer? Yeah, the mommy, let's see. The rainbow. <laughs> All right, so third one. It's really nice. Okay, and then we're gonna do the fourth toe. Make sure that you really massage on top of your foot over this ball as much as possible. Very nice, your entire area. And then moving on to the fourth. Stretch them out, stretch them out. They're about like a 33 joint, you know, in um, each foot. So we really have to make them nice and soft and have them uh, move it you know, nicely. And then moving on to the second pinky, you know, I mean the, your last one, the pinky toe, pinky toe. All right, very nice. How you feeling, Melissa? Are you okay? Yeah, good. Very nice, right here too. The pinky toe, pinky toe. Okay, very good. Now let's go into right here. So there's a little um, area where you know you can 
field at this little concave area. So we're gonna go right here. So ankle, the front of the ankle. Okay, very good, excellent. Now, perfect. Now we're gonna actually do this. We're gonna put your feet like this. Uh, there, there's uh, and the bones, your ankles, right around it. We're gonna go like a little half circle motion. Yeah. Very good. Right here. And then your heel. These are right there. Very good. Excellent. And then this Achilles tendon right here, right there. Up and down motion. Very good. And also the heel right here. Very good. So right here, circle. Very nice. The heel, excellent. All right, right there we did right under this area, circle, and the heel. <laughs> right here and then we're gonna go the big toe right here so there's the bones and right here it's right in between right there yeah right here so yeah this one is really really hard so up and down like this it's totally fine because this is such a you know soft hole you can go up and down all the way up here, this area, all the way, all the way. Press it really hard. Oops. Press it very hard. Okay. Bring some water, honey, so you can drink, you know, you feel good. Yeah. Very good. So, yes, bring your feet right down here. So. They show them so right from here, right there, really hard like this. Also because if there's um there's some muscles right here, so I'm going to like this one really nice and relaxed. Yeah, this is how much you're actually going to put the pressure on it, and then also right here this is feel the difference. Oh yeah, <laughs> yeah. So doing this way, also this the big uh, big toe muscle has to work really well. So this the big toe has to function or whatever it has to function. Otherwise, you will compensate other muscle to walk. You know, it's really important to do that. Now I feel. Yeah. So <laughs> yeah. So now you feel hot. So that yeah. means that the blood is basically circulating. So that's yeah, good. So whoever, yeah. So whoever watching this right now and um, whoever watching this now, <laughs> follow this. And uh, if you feel there's a little um, hot sensation, it's totally fine. It's okay. So your blood is basically circulating. That's totally okay. All right. So we're gonna keep going up and down. And also each um, each toe. The distance from you know your big toes and down, uh, it shouldn't be really clasped down this way. Sometimes you know, people actually have a really small gap because people normally wear really tight shoes, so their toe has no room to spread them out. So make sure to open them up. Okay, so let's try to do this. Open. You can do them like this. So yeah, you can totally do that. If your hands tired, you can do that as well. So we're gonna do this. Very good and love your toes. We did the front side, so we have to do the you know the bottom side and so really trying to make them uh, yeah straight as much as possible. So when you do this, you'll be able to actually see the vein is slowly popping out. So yeah, yeah, see I can see I can see that the vein is popping out. That's really good. That's really fantastic, you did really well. So we did that. And that's pretty good. So let's do the other side. So what we're going to do, um, let's try to do, you know, the ankle right below. We're going to do that. And then the Achilles tendons right here. 
Maybe I just go this way. So, no, it's okay. Yeah, so you, you can show. You can, yeah, right here. So I'll just do it for her. Yeah. There we go. Are you okay, Mia? If anybody who has a shoulder issue, let's target right here. Heart. Heart. Very hard. Alright. Excellent. It's so all the way down. So this is like a self-massage, you know? It's similar to reflexology. And you can do it at home. Alright, very nice. Okay, so we already did the other side, but anyway, so let, let's, let, let's test him out. Okay, so we're gonna go a little bit to the back. Um, okay, so what we're going to do, flex your feet, point your toe, point, good. Flex your feet, <laughs> point your toe. But we already did this one, so and you don't know, have a nail. I mean, it feels already good, right? This one feels good. Better now. Yeah, this, now this one's yeah better. Good. good. And then now let's try to do this. Now what we're going to do? We're gonna uh, really open the toe big. Open one, two, three, four, five, and relax. And stretch, spread your toe. Spread your toe. One, two, three, four, five. And let me see. <laughs> and we'll do one, two, three, four, five. Oh, nice. And last one. One, two, three, four, five. Good. Now, slice your feet. Now we're going to curl your bit to curl. Curl. One, two, three, four, one. And curl. One, two, three, four, one. And Curl, two, three, four, one. And curl, two, three, four, one. And one more time. One, two, three, four, one. Good job. So it's very, very important that we really have to um, spread your toe very good. Like, spread your toe, spread your toe. And you'll be able to do this. So um, uh, maybe I'll be just doing here. So when you curl up your toe, you have to do this really well, guys. You have to do this so that you'll be able to have. Uh, maybe I should do this so that you'll be able to strengthen the muscles right below and stretch. And one, two. It's very important. Two. Very good. So very nice. I'm gonna um, let me see. Maybe I can here. Can you do that? Curl up your toe. Curl one. Stretch and curl up your toe. Stretch. Good. And curl up your toe. Stretch. One more time. Curl up your toe. Stretch. And curl up your toe. Stretch. One more time. A little bit too. Stretch. Perfect. Excellent. Good job. How are you feeling? Good. Feel better? So I'm sure that when you walk, um, you feel much better. So when you walk, guys, walk, 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 trying to use your toes. Okay, so trying to use all five toes. So mommy, so you have to, yeah, when you walk, really use, you have to wear the, the big toe, you have to grab it. So it's like whenever you play piano, you have, you're using all five toes, right? Um, we have to give a same freedom to our, you know, our feet, don't you think? Our hands always free, but our feet always stuck inside the shoes and they don't breathe and they have no air they always become a little stinky and like sweaty so we always wash our hands we don't wash our feet as often as what you know, we do it to our hands don't you think that we should give a little more freedom to our feet then your feet basically won't be able to deform because as you get older you wear certain type of shoes especially tight shoes 
Therefore, your toes slowly becoming like, you know, what you're wearing. Especially, um, let's see, when you're growing up, you know, you might gonna to wear heels. When you wear heels, you're gonna use your heels and the balls and to stand and your toes, your five toes, quite not for the function. So you might actually create a like claw toes or hammer toes so that your toes gonna be looking like like very kind of little you know set like this like this. But anyway so open toes as much as possible so when you walk we're gonna really really do this. One, two, one, two. Okay so the exercise this one is very important, right? And if you want, you can use the ball to grab the ball. Grab the ball and go. Try this oh, one here. Yeah. 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 Can you grab the balls really hard and let go? Okay. So grab the grab the ball and then squeeze the ball. Squeeze the ball as if you're using the hands. So grab and let go. So Melissa, when you studying, you can put the balls underneath of your desk and just, yeah, exactly, do that for both, both feet so they can relax. Hey, hey Mom. Nice. Okay. Keep doing it. Keep doing it. Keep doing it. You have to do the other side too. All right. Yeah. Good. So that your feet actually exercise, you know. By playing. Very nice, Melis. Very nice. Excellent. <laughs> Alright. Okay, so now let's. Would you like to stand up and we're gonna do a little stretch? Very good. So now open your feet, keep it apart. Okay. And we're gonna go up, down. Yeah, up. So, if anybody who can do this, you can have a little uh, chair in front of you. You can hold onto the chair and do it. Now we're going to go all the way up and down. And all the way up and down. And three, two, three. And down. One, two, three. Spread your toes and down. And five, two, three. Right side front, left side leg straight to the back. So make sure that, yeah. So, make sure that, um, yeah, this is going to go a little bit to the lower half. Yeah. So, yeah. Yeah. Make sure that the back side, the back side of your foot has to be grounded. And really make sure that your cat muscle is stretching. Entire soul also stretch. Try not to uh, put your heels up of your stay hold. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Perfect, good job. So let's go to the other side. Okay, so mama, you can just hold up the chair. Very good. Some people um, who has a really tight cap, so your heels are actually lifted a little bit up this, a little bit up this way. But it's okay. They're trying to put it down as much as possible. And go down to the bottom. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. I'm sure that now your your gait. <laughs> Your game makes me so much better. Okay, so let's try to. Your legs. Yeah, your legs. Bye. Wiggle, wiggle. Can you wiggle? Can you wiggle? Can you do like just like your fingers? Just like your fingers. 
No, no, no. Everything is possible. Impossible means I am possible. I am possible. So,